This is, I think, my favorite opening sequence in like any video game I've ever played. Wake up, Link. It just makes you think of like Skyrim, where you're just sitting on a horse for like five minutes, getting fed fucking exposition. What the fucking heck is that over there? What the fucking heck is that over there? <laughs> All right, if you've never seen this game, you might be like, yo, Aiden, why is this your favorite game introduction? And I'm just gonna let the game speak for itself. So, we could go, if you've never played this game, we could go up any of these mountains, anywhere, we could just go, we could, we could basically run to the end of the game right now and go fight the final boss right now if we wanted to. That's the alert of this game. You're just sort of thrown into the world and you have to like pick it up yourself. And holy shit, no game does it better than this game, I feel like. Where, 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 holy shit, I'm tall as fuck, Link, don't try no funny shit. <laughs> yeah, this is crazy, though, like, can they hear me on stream? I hear, dude, you're capping, bro, this kid's on cap. Dude, the delay's like two seconds, he called me saying there's a delay. Five seconds later in the same call, I hear what I just said over stream. That's, that's Benly Mega Cappy right there, dude. <laughs> At least put the TV on mute if you want to run the bit. I can't get over that shit. <laughs> Link. 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 Head for the point. Why am I the reading it? There's voice Link. acting. <laughs> Ooh, bang! Get hit with. Oh, we had we had good shit. Why didn't I use my good shit? Come on, let's do it again. Ooh, I'm insane! <laughs> and we got your shield, give me your dumb shield. We did a couple glitches, like essence duping, to make it easier for us, but I'm just gonna do like it legit. I, I think I feel like master mode's like way too fucking hard. At least for me. I mean, I, I was able to get through the whole game. I beat the whole game, I did like some of the DLC. It's like the, the the trials of the sword specifically that just like really showed to me the the flaws with the changes in master mode. Like I I think the whole health regen thing is bullshit. It does not work with a, a weapons like a, a depleting weapon system at all. It's it's also just like I feel like it's just so stressful. Where this is just like the regular mode is just so pleasant. It's like that vast of a difference. I feel like. Also, when I played Master Mode, I, like, rushed through the fucking game. Like, we did Essence duping. I didn't do... Which made us, so, like, I didn't... It killed, like, the motivation to do shrines. So I'm excited to just be able to, like, take in the game. Take in the world. Because what a fucking world. I mean, just look at everything that we could do here. I have a friend. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna say which friend. Like, they told me one of the funniest fucking story about their dad. I've never heard anyone tell a funnier story about their own dad. So, their dad... When they were like, like a teenager, right? They were at Disney World, on Main Street. Okay, just to get the get the mental image in your head. <laughs> just to get the mental image in your head. My friend's dad goes up to some uh, person, a particular uh, racial descent that they may not have liked. That's the, that's the best way I can say that. <laughs> and they also happen to be annoying them. Uh, so my friend's dad choke slammed someone, Ch choke slammed like choke slammed, like WWE right in front of the ca right in front of the Magic Kingdom fucking castle. H how how gorgeous, how poetic, and to this day I've never heard like anyone do anything crazier in an amusement park. Just imagine getting choke slammed in general. <laughs> that shit is crazy. I think it would be pretty funny to go the to the last area of the game and get some crazy good weapons.
You have executed great stamina. Obamna! Soda! Soda! What was the context of Joe Biden screaming soda? Because I'm, I'm thinking... I can't think of any. I bet you can't either. <laughs> Obama memes. What do I get? What am I supposed to get from you typing Obama memes in fucking chat? <laughs> oh my god, why is that the funniest thing in chat? <laughs> Obama beatboxes? Did you just walk out of a time machine from like 2012? Did I not know about the, the 2012 time machine? I wonder what- I wonder what- Oh, right, it's my first time taking it out. I wonder what these three rocks in particular could be. I'm gonna stand on them and... Oh, oh! It's the stone man. It's the motherfucking stone man. It's the motherfucking stone man. Oh, we're gonna do it. Fuck, we we are not gonna do it. Being this, we should be on the money here. He has no arms. I don't know what to climb. Him. Oh, we just got more. That's fancy. That's funny to me because I never died to it. Yeah, that's not condescending. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. Just, just, just hop off. Let me, let me, let me win. Let me fail at my own pace. If you want to compare it to yourself, just go play the game yourself. Go you up. Oh, you're right. Turn it off, face cam. It's fun to charge for a little bit. It's okay though. This game looks really nice. You didn't you know what? I hate playing with this off. With this on, because you can't really do waypoints, but it's the plateau, it's easy enough. This guy's getting the 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 shit next. Perhaps not. Man, I want to blow up the fucking... I want to blow these up, but I guess it's too late now. There's just no one else in here? It's just him. Oh, let's go. That's pretty cool, actually. What the fuck is this cave? I've never noticed this cave. Oh, does this teach you about letting a fire? That's a... That's cool that they just put that there. You gotta, like, learn that. <laughs> How come I just heard, like, a car go off? Did you just hear, like, a car go... Arr! Look, Brian! Oh, that was a, such a shitty Stewie Griffin impression. I'm not even gonna continue. I'm not even gonna continue. That was that bad. <laughs> that was some goofy off, but this looks like fun, huh? Yeah, Can we bullet time if we don't have the fucking tire ladder? Okay. You can. That's kind of sick. That's that money. A fucking beehive in here, dude. You gotta take care of the bees. That's how I do it in real life. I just hit all the bees collectively with one sword strike. Then the problem is just taken care of. Gotta get Cam back ASAP, yeah. Fuck, man. Let me see what... What's battery looking like? Ho! Oh, did you know you could cut down trees? Yeah, bitch. Watch this. Watch this. I'm goaded. Oh, we got spicy peppers here. You could actually make a cold resistant fucking elixir and go up to the cold part without having to just 
Barrett. That's actually hype. Well, let's make us an Alexa. Let's fucking go. I had a pretty crazy summer. I had a pretty, 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 pretty crazy summer. Uh, in both the very good and very bad ways. Uh, many things happen, as usually does during a long period of three months, four months. Yeah, I guess I have some stories to tell. Why, why not? Might as well kick back, tell a couple stories. I'm trying to think about a good place to start. So I'm a, I'm a Boy Scout, I'm an Eagle Scout. Every single year, uh, the troop that I'm involved with goes up to this camp, Camp Sequoasin. It's in, like, northern Connecticut every every year, every single summer. A bunch of other troops go there. There's food that's catered every single day, three meals a day, so... Uh, and there's a bunch of merit badges for the kids to do. Uh, me, Connor, uh, Baldy, who was on stream. Uh, is this the shrine just right here, dude? What the fuck? Bunch of other people. Bunch of people, like, in, in, in the Wild West, right? Uh, we're all adults, uh, if not Eagle Scouts. Uh, so David too. David was in the, David's been in a couple of the vlogs. We're all adults, so we don't have to do anything. We could just show up at the meals. We don't, have, we don't even have to show up at the meals. We just show up at the meals because we hungry. <laughs> we just had a great time. It was basically at that point, a vacation with the boys in the woods. That was awesome. <laughs> Like, sometimes I'd sleep in if I want to, and like, every single day for the adults, they would have, like, a special coffee bar with like a bunch of flavored coffees. Dude, fucking banging, dude. What a, what a great way to like, really put the summer into motion. Just, just walking around camp every single day, doing dumb things. There was a different time we were there, so it was a different, uh, staffing than the normal summer camp staffing. And we were there, I think, on like a shooting trip or something. It was around this time of the year. Uh, Shane, who's been fucking texting me all night, was there. Because uh, my dad was like, see if Shane wants to come. Uh, and, you know, Shane and Shane ended up coming. Shane loves fucking Sequoia. Sequoia's in such a vibe, that camp. Mind you, it was pretty late at night. We were going back to camp. Uh, we had no idea uh that this was the case one and two how long this was the case but we were being followed uh it was a cit of or like some they had a cit shirt i don't even i think it turned out that that kid wasn't even a cit i remember f like actually like getting pissed at him the next day and it something like that turned out i did not take lightly to it though so turns out he was he was following us and he was following us close and none of us had any fucking idea that that was the case for how long i don't fucking know but i turn around robbie like baldy robbie screams or like he doesn't scream but he's like ah I go like, oh fuck, it's a dude, or something. Like I'm playing, like I'm playing Fortnite. <laughs> like I'm giving cards to my friends. We all just book it. Cause why wouldn't you? Uh, we all run so fucking fast. And for a long time too. I ran so much and so fast. I had recently bought an Apple Watch, and I w I've been wearing it throughout the summer into that, like, fall. I've never had a higher recorded heart rate. On that fucking, on that watch. It, like, let me know. It was like, yo, your heart rate was, was actually through the fucking roof. That's some of the craziness that happens at Camps of Kwasin. But my summer continued! Trip with my friends, some of my friends, to Block Island was was in the talks and then it went from being in the talks to in the works and then it went from being in the works to they were on their way to pick me up one one fateful summer morning this morning very early like six in the fucking morning sun's up sun's just coming up i got a text aiden be outside we're almost here be ready we want to get on the road we want to make the ferry i'm sitting on my front porch I'm sitting on my front porch, and I'm just on my phone. I'm just, like, playing chess or whatever the fuck. And I hear 
a screech and a crash and glass. And it turns out that it was my friends who got into the car accident. How, how did I find this out, by the way? I was like, I, I was like being a little curious. I was looking and I see one of my friends. I see like their hair at the intersection. And I was like, oh my fucking fucking. And then I had to do a fucking stupid long drive because everybody was, every, I was the only person who was going that wasn't in a car crash. Uh. Oh, by the way, I should mention this. They weren't. Well, that's very important <laughs> that I say that. I'm just telling the story like we just went. Uh, cops cleared uh, everything. It was all good. Um, everybody was okay. So yeah, we, we did end up missing our ferry by a little bit. By a little bit, I mean a lot of bit. We had to take the next ferry. Uh, it was like over an hour and a half later, and even then we were kind of short. Um, I was the only person who wasn't shaken up from being in a car crash, so I was the only person who could have realistically driven, and I was not preparing preparing for this. That's why you just sit in the car all morning. It just fucking vibe. Another thing that was really funny, though, about our town this summer was that the fireworks, the 4th of July fireworks were on in September last month. <laughs> That was really fucking funny. We we walked down like it was 4th of July, man. Like it felt like it was the 4th of July just from one night. Uh, after we came back from Block Island, it was only it was only a night. I lost my AirPods on Block Island too because I had no idea even fucking brought them because the the hecticness that was getting out there and coming back. No idea I had them on me and I must have fucking they must have fell out of my bag or something. I checked my find my uh, when I get home. Cause I'm like, did I need to like pack my AirPods by accident? I don't have my AirPods, so I thought they would just be like be on my my couch where I like would let leave them like in my house, in my room, right? No, I checked to find my. They are like a state over, in the middle of an island somewhere, off 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 the mainland. <laughs> Some cleaning person or whoever's staying there next just got themselves a free pair of AirPods. Fuck me, dude. <laughs> I swear to God, though, next time I buy AirPods, I am going to, without a doubt, buy an AirTag and have it, like, chained to the fucking AirTag. I don't care how goofy it looks. It's just, it's just for the peace of mind. Shane's flaming, Shane's flaming for choosing a frisbee golf and a coffee bar story for what happened at the class. And it was nice! It was pleasant! Dude, I would want to go back, like, to, to, like, a king and, like, give him, like, a blinker off of, like, a dab cart. Like, keep pulling it, bro. Keep pulling it. If I could go back in time, that's what I would do. And fuck it, I don't care how the timeline gets fucked up. I don't care about the repercussions. Maybe maybe weed becomes like universally recognized as goaded in the early adoption of the dab pen as early as 1600. This is hype. Oh, yes. So satisfying when you fucking finally get the paraglider. This thing... ...puts open world games to shame by itself. Connor was telling me he really likes using promo because there's enough signs everywhere... ...in visual landmarks... ...where you really could just... ...navigate without a minimap. Obviously, I'm gonna check into it a bunch to, for waypoints and stuff, but this is not a good idea just going into Hyrule Castle right now. I'm gonna fucking do it. I know it didn't say that, but it, I. Did it say busty hearted rat roasted radish? No. Not even close. Why did I. <laughs> I didn't even say anything. Busty party radish. Wait. It's too late. I'm on the train now. You're right. Bird eggs. Honk. Gotcha, gotcha, bitch. Got your eggs. Took your eggs, lady. <laughs> Let's do this shit. Oh, 
terrifying. This is fucking terrifying, bro. This guy is creepy. Oh, Crazy shit. Good thing we prevented that. Bang. Eileen shield on the first night. <laughs> the motherfucking Hylian shield. I might do early Master Sword. The only reason for that doesn't kill like the progression, like at all. I think it helps it having like a rechargeable weapon too. I wouldn't be surprised if uh, Tears of the Kingdom started off with some sort of like base rechargeable weapon. Yep. I really wouldn't. I just didn't like that we did the essence stooping. That was like the only thing I regret doing. <laughs> so it really made it that we didn't need to go to shrines. You got the fucking Master Sword. <laughs> Holy fuck, look at this thing, huh? Alright, that's gonna do it for me for tonight, everybody. I hope you enjoyed tonight's stream. Have a good one. See you later.